Well, hello again, human beings from the planet Earth. You know, I've been telling you for a while, and it looks like I'm going to have to tell you again. It's not only the humans that are losing their fucking minds. The animals are as well. Uh, last year saw just a big uptick in animal attacks, and this year starting out the same few of the most recent headlines. Crocodile attacks a woman in waist-deep water. A uh, crocodile has bitten a woman in the leg while she was swimming in a remote bay in western Australia's Kimberley region. Terra Hawks 23 was swimming in a freshwater pool near the tourist vessel True North in Dugong Bay, north of Derby, on Sunday afternoon when a two-meter crocodile bit her upper leg as she left the water. Outstanding. Wild boar attacks a woman. Rubia Samad, 54, was with two relatives when the incident happened at 9.30. A.M. The mother of eight suffered injuries to her left leg and sought outpatient treatment at Raja Parapuram Zanabib Hospital in Kota Baru. Recalling the incident, uh, Rubia said she had been busy collecting the mushrooms at about 100 meters from her house when she spotted a wild boar uh, appearing out of nowhere. The animal behaved aggressively and started to go near one of her relatives. She said the wild boar was medium-sized and height reached her waist. Good Lord, killer pigs. Got killer swans as well. Killer swan attacks an Illinois caretaker until he drowns. This is coming out of the Los Angeles Times. April 16th, swans have seemingly placid demeanor and their monogamous mating habits have long made them a symbol of lasting love, but the creatures, generally snowy white with long graceful necks and a black mask around their eyes, are territorial and can be quite aggressive when threatened. Anthony Hensley found out, 37-year-old married father of two, got attacked by a swan till he drowned. Good Lord. And this, Kiwanis Island Park in Merritt Island remains closed after uh, raccoon attacks. Aggressive raccoons are terrorizing visitors at the Kiwanis Island Park in Merritt Island, which shut down over the weekend after a pair of claw and fang attacks. So you see... It's not just the humans that are losing their mind. Due to circumstances beyond our control, 2012 has arrived and there will be hell on earth.